Hello everybody and welcome back once again to Let's Play Skyrim. Verdina? Hello? Verdina? Okay, stand by folks, Berlina just decided to go running off somewhere. <laughs> Berlina? What are you doing? Come on, silly, silly fool, panicking over nothing. <sighs> Excuse me. <laughs> A rather strange start to today's affairs, I feel. Come on. Come on! Seems to be a problem with my uh, menu nowadays. I can't seem to uh, go left or right anymore. This is the second time this has happened to me. I want to get my quest log on. There we go. <sighs> right. Should I try this again, Berlina? <laughs> Hello everybody, welcome back once again to Let's Play Skyrim. Uh, last time we left off. Um, we uh, entered Anvil Anselvund in order to try and locate a staff for Enthia, one of our college students. Now that we are Archmage, we decided that college business will take priority, and therefore we headed all the way over here to retrieve a measly staff. That is how devoted we are to our students' welfare. Anyway, in the process of trying to find said staff, we managed to stumble across uh, a madwoman who was... Uh, trying to revive her dead husband, who had been killed in some sort of, some kind of struggle for the Empire. I don't know where I'm going, by the way. <laughs> Just bear with me. And, uh, yes, in the process of trying to kill her, we managed to find out a little bit more about the legend of Fiori and Holgier, that book we read so long ago at the very start. I think it was actually one of the very first books we read. <coughs> but anyway, we learned a bit about Fiori and Helgir, and hell, we met the spirits of Fiori and Helgir as we freed them from the clutches of this madwoman, who'd uh, basically raised them to do her bidding. All in a day's work for an archmage, eh? Anyhow, today's session will involve us meeting a random stranger in the road, having Brina run off on us in random moments. Hello? Fine, turn your back on me. What you doing up this late? Greetings, brother. You look weary. I have something to help you relax, if you're interested. Uh, no, thank you. Mm -hmm. A bed should suffice. I don't need to resort to uh, drugs. Anyhow, come on, Berlina. Leave the strange Argonian to his uh, drug dealing ways. And somebody might want to tell him that drug dealing at the crack of, well, the crack of dawn, in the middle of the night, is probably not the most lucrative of business ideas. And again, I suppose there are the least number of guards about at this time. So, yes, what was I saying? Yes, we are going to head back to the College of Winterhold to hand the staff to Enfy, which will hopefully uh, mean that he gives us an amulet of some sort so that we can give that to Onlund. He will be happy, Enfy will be happy, we'll all be happy, and we can focus on what we're going to do today. Now, what we're going to do today is uh, first of all we're going to find an inn to rest at. It's two. It's three o'clock in the morning, and uh, we need. We haven't slept yet, so we'll have a nice bit of a rest at the Braidwood. I think it's at the Braidwood Inn. It's just down the road here. <coughs> There's a starter for ten. In fact, we might get a move on. Yeah. Have a bite to eat. Late night, midnight snack. Past midnight, three a.m., four a.m. snack. By the time we get there, then we shall head back to the college, Hannah. And after we've done that, we are going to take a day off. Elwyn is tired after a short sprint. She's definitely not an Olympian. But it's more so than Berlina. Uh, yes, we've done a lot of questing recently, and although we're still going to strive to ensure that we manage, uh, we finish college affairs at some point, at some point, as a priority, before we do anything else, any other quest line, we're going to ensure that all college business is taken care of. But uh, before we even do any more college business, I think it's about time we have a day or two off. A lot of things have happened over the past few uh, few days, even beyond the past few days, where, you know, overwhelming things. Becoming Archmage, going into the mind of a madman, all these kind of things. Going to ruins, getting 
almost killed by dragons landing in the college and all yeah, a whole host of things have happened over the past few days I think Archmage Elwyn has definitely earned at least one day off now many moons ago it seems when we were in Rorikstead we received a flyer from a random stranger highlighting that we might want to visit the museum in Dawnstar and therefore why not so in our day off today later today a dead wolf we are going to head towards the uh, who are these people head towards the, Dor uh, the the museum of Dawnstar to see what delights it has in store for us wow who's this guy oh an orc ah oh, Mike it does not matter to Maik how strong or smart one is. It only matters what one can do. Hmm. I think that might be reference to Skyrim's new kind of Dragons leveling were never system. Gone. They were just invisible and very, very quiet. Okay, and? Maik is tired. Now. Okay, thank you for your insight. Over to somebody else. Bye bye. Goodbye. Oh, where's this orc wandering? I, 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 I wonder. <laughs> What's a milk drinker like you doing out here? Go home to your mother. Oh, if I say this, she's probably going to attack me, so I've had a long day. I'll be leaving now. That's right. Archmage and all, we must uh, ensure that we be above such petty insults. You can insult me all you want. I have the patience of a saint now. I'm the changed man. I will no longer quick to uh, cause fights in the middle of inns with the Nord woman who insulted me in the same fashion. Come on to the Braidwood Inn before dawn breaks. In fact, we've probably passed it. No, we haven't. It's right here. Uh, hey, Bit of a rest, some food, and we'll be good to press on towards Winterhold. Yes, indeed. It's only a short stop, Berlina. Don't be looking forward to ale and wine. It shall merely be a quick bite, a power nap, and onwards. Ah, marvellous. I do like the refreshing crackle of a warm fire as we admire our Archmage robes, yes. Greetings, Idra. Now here's a man I'm glad to see. Glad to see you too. Can I have something to eat? I hope you'll stay for a bit. We could certainly take a look. Thank you so much. Right, uh, what shall I have? Uh, as I say, it's a, it's a flying visit. Nord mead. Rabbit haunch. Rabbit haunch will do me. Some baked, baked tatties. And uh, well, I said we weren't going to have any, but why not? Wash it down with some ale and some wine. Thank you. Thank you very much. In fact, well, this is really a room. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Show me through. I'll show you to your room. Right this place. Come on, Berlina. I have our dinner right here. And despite me saying we're not going to have any alcoholic beverages today, I couldn't resist. Let me know if there's anything else you need. Bless you, Idra. Your patronage is always most welcome. Thank you so much. Ah, the songs of Skyrim. Shall I actually sing you one? Last time I didn't sing because I was... Uh, no, I'll refrain. I'll refrain. Idra. Thank you. I'm... Ah, lovely. Right. Uh, we'll eat. We'll go to bed. And then we shall be up in the morning fresh as a daisy. So join us when we have refreshed. Morning all. Little killed is a handful, and Froa is just so quiet. Yep. Hi guys, bye guys, thanks again. I am blocking the door. Killed speaks for Kynesgrove. Anyone who says otherwise is aching for a fight. I, I don't want to fight, but I don't want to fight. I, I'm happy with with Kynesgrove. It's a nice place. Many a time it has saved me from going uh, mad with hunger and tiredness. I've stopped at this inn. I think three or four times now. Anyway, we've had a five hour sleep, we've had our food, and we're ready to move on. Seen the remnants of the grove? That? Well, that was me. 
Me and my sister. What grove? Came here to start a lumber mill. Who knew the Nords cared about a bunch of old trees? What do you mean? Aren't things going too well for you? We got the mill up and running before we found out that the big stand of trees on the hill was sacred. Now we can't cut them, and we can't afford to buy another mill somewhere else. Oh, how So we scrounge whatever we can from around the tundra. Oh, well. Never mind. All right, then. Go on, Berlina. Nothing we can fix, of course. It's just bad luck. Luckily for us, there is a carriage outside uh, Windhelm, so we don't have to run the whole way back to Winterhold. We can take the carriage. So that should speed matters up slightly. I thought we could collect this. Maybe we already have... We might already have done. Come on, Berlina, let's go. I think actually Dawnstar is actually uh, is a major city, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, let's take a quick look on the map. Mappy map map. How do you get map on? I played this game for a while. There we go. Not there. Excellent. Don't start. Look there. Poof. It is a city. Probably not a major city like Windhelm or Winterhold. Uh, not Winterhold. Or uh, Whiterun. There I go again with my W towns. Getting them all mixed up. Uh, Don't start. Yes. Probably not quite as big. Probably doesn't even have a carriage to be honest with you. But. Uh, there's a museum there, and as I say, today is our day off. Although by the time we get the carriage back to Winterhold, it might be a little bit late in the day. Hello there! Don't you just look at me like that. Hello! Need a ride? Yes! Where do you want to go? Winterhold, please. 50 gold pieces, wow. Climb and back, and we'll be off. Okie dokie. Oh, young up we get. Little snow never stopped me. Don't worry. Oh, I'm not worried. Or maybe slightly. 4 p.m. Hmm. What we'll do is we'll do our college business. We'll finish up our college business. See what time it is. And if it's still sort of early evening, then we'll uh, head to uh, Dawnstar now. Stay overnight in the inn at Dawnstar, and then in the morning we shall visit the uh, the, the the museum. Archmage Elwin returns, relieving Tolfdir of his temporary position as overseer in our absence of the college. Oh, there you all are. Just the man I wanted to see. End there. The Archmage Triumph, the College, Skyrim, all of Tamriel owes you a great debt. Ah, uh, that was nothing, please. And uh, well, we're on the theme of triumphant. I've been triumphant in Anselvan, because here is your staff. And as bargained for, do you have the amulet? Pleasure doing business with you. Marvellous. Thank you very much. And, uh, have a good day. Alright then. Right. Well, let's give the amulet to Onmund. Ah, there he is, sat down, chilling out, having a bite to eat maybe. No, just sort of staring into space. Onmund! How are you? I never would have suspected that the eye could be so dangerous. Tofty. Here's your amulet. <laughs> I didn't think you'd really give it back. Thank you, friend. It's good to know I can count on you. Yes, you can count on me. Feel free to come to me with your problems. All right, then. Goodbye. All right, Belina, quickly we need to go to my quarters, offload the treasure that we're going to sell at some point in the future, and then we are off to Dawnstar. Ah, look at that. So crisp.